Hi, I'm Ruth Werner, and it is my joyful task to spend time with the presenters for the 2021 AFMTE Educators Congress coming up in July, July 16 and 17. And today I am really pleased to be able to spend some time with my friend, Deanna Sylvester. Deanna, would you like to introduce yourself, please? Well, hi, and I'm so excited to be with Ruth, my <laughs> friend Ruth. Um, I'm Deanna. I've been a massage therapist for 18 years. I've been an educator for decades, a little bit longer than 18 years, maybe, but specifically in massage for about 15 years. And uh, recently I've had had the opportunity and the honor to be part of the educator certification project for the Alliance and be the project manager. And so um, I'm excited to be part of the the virtual educational Congress and continue that relationship. So wonderful. So you will be presenting well, you'll be joining us for lunch. The yeah. Lunch and Learn on Saturday, July 17th. So the first and most important question is, what are you bringing for lunch? Well, that's a great question. Hmm. Usually my answer would be peanut butter and jelly because that's what I gave to my daughter to take to school for lunch <laughs> for years and years. But no, um, I don't know. I, maybe I'll have like a meatball sub and we can just get messy and get into the information. <laughs> I want everybody to bring their lunch because that's way going to be way more fun um, than what we're talking about. And what we're talking about is going to be fun. So, And what would that be? We're going to be talking about the teacher training program that is offered through the Alliance. So, Deanna, just give us yeah. a thumbnail sketch of why people need to bring their meatball subs to Lunch and Learn on Saturday, July 17th. Uh, well, first of all, if they haven't, if they aren't familiar with the educator certification project uh, that the Alliance has been working on for many years now, they need to come because I'll give a little snippet, a little summary of the fact that uh, a really cool committee called the, I think the the certification process committee. And I think maybe you were part of that committee. I might've, I might've chaired that committee. <laughs> you might've chaired that committee, <laughs> um, developed some really cool stuff. One of which was the uh, the portfolio review process for teachers who are already in massage and body work to be able to have a process for certification. And now we're ready to show off this thing we're calling the model curriculum, which the, the committee worked on and it's brilliant. It's actually um, eight courses and a practicum of, uh, of recommended courses to really help people to not only learn how to teach and it's really designed for kind of entry level teachers and maybe and maybe new um, continuing education providers to um, learn how to teach what they're already an expert in. And so uh, these courses are designed really to help people learn how to teach in a in a adult education, higher education, and they're specific to somatic based education. So it's really, um, it's really brilliant. I look forward to sharing that curriculum with, with folks. And especially if you're thinking of taking some teacher training classes, the Alliance is going to offer those at some point, we're working on a project now. And if you're thinking of doing, uh, creating a teacher training program for yourself or your school or your organization, um, this model can be used in the same way maybe that you use the ELAP blueprint for creating an, a, a curriculum for entry-level massage therapists. So um, I look forward to sharing that with everybody. Well, thanks, Dana. And I just want to yeah. clarify then, this model curriculum is not about the material that is presented in a massage classroom. It is right. a model curriculum for teachers to develop their skills as yeah. educators. Right? It really is. It's specific. It's something that that little kernel that's so important that's been missing in massage education or not really consistent in massage education for teachers to learn how to teach, how to understand the learning process so that we can create activities in the classroom that are actually effective for learning. And so, yeah, it's really um, it's really brilliant. And if, unless unless you plan to go to school to get your master's or, or doctorate in education, specifically in educational delivery, this is the way to go if you're a <laughs> practitioner. So 
you know, I might be a little biased, but this, but what the what the committee came up with is really brilliant, and I look forward to helping facilitate that. So, well, I can tell that you have some strong feelings about this project, and and it's always a pleasure to spend time with people who are passionate about their work. So. Thanks, Deanna, and um, all the cool people will be joining us for lunch on Saturday, July 17th for Deanna Sylvester's Lunch and Learn about the model curriculum for teacher training. Thanks, everybody. Excellent. Thank you.